That was a swift lunch. Tell me you've grown a work ethic or something. Oh, get help, you freak. Don't worry. I'm happy for you. <laughs> You're right, laugh that fellow of yours, isn't it? Whatever. Walk away while you still can. Cracks me up. Should have heard him last night. Trying to pay me to keep away from you. You're yeah, right. <laughs> Actually had his checkbook out. Told him not to waste his money, though. What little he thinks you're worth. Well, that's a flaming joke coming from you, isn't it? Have a guess. Have a guess. How much he offered me for you. You're twisted, you know that? No, I put him straight. I told him you don't need a pimp running things for you. Did you? Mm. Well, guess what? Don't care what you said. And yes, we do have a laugh. Mainly about you. For now. Don't work too hard, sweetheart. Bye. You know what gets me? Is that he thinks that I'm the easy target. He's not going for you or charity. It is not like that. If it's your problem, it's my problem. No, mate, she's the problem. You can't keep blaming charity. You're not the one that's not getting any sleep. Wouldn't be an issue in the first place if you'd kept it in your pants. Look, I'm just saying, get out there and show him that you're not scared. Instead of hiding in here. So go on, how much do you think I'm worth? It must be pretty damn cheap if Kim won't even take your money. Look, I was going to How many tell more you... times do I have to say this? You cannot buy me, he cannot sell me, and you do not ever go behind my back. Right. He tried to get heavy with Nikhil. Look, and the way he's yeah, been right. getting to yeah. you... Tell, tell the world. Look, I thought it'd make him back off. I'm sorry, remind me here who it was who was banging on about. Don't give him a reaction. Don't let him drive a wedge. And what are you going to do? Practice what you flaming well preach. Look, will you please let me explain? No, I'm talking at the moment. You went behind my back and made a complete fool out of me, and now you've given him exactly what he wants. And if you continue to do this, it will encourage him all the more. I did it for us. We'll carry on like this and there won't be an us to worry about. Got it? <laughs> no offence, but if you're going to do the whole girl power routine, don't run over and do the ironing. Well, let me tell you, there is something reassuring about having a very heavy, very hot piece of metal in my hand, so just you be careful. I was only taking a make. Yeah? Well, I've left yours to Fester, right? Because these are Noah's. Because he's about the only male who does not think that I have a for sale sign slapped on me. All right, look, I'm sorry. You were right. I was out of line. <laughs> and if you think I'm falling for your lip service, <laughs> no way. I'm sorry, what is that? An apology. Well, you know, part of it. Just for starters. Right. Has anything I've said penetrated that microscopic excuse for a brain? Stop trying to buy me! I am not! You've just been that miserable over the last few days. And it's all my fault. I thought the least I could do was try and cheer you up. Hmm. Right. Hmm. Seen worse, obviously. And if you don't mind, I've booked us a table at a place that'll do the dress justice and the lady wearing it. Yeah, and who's she? Oh, please. Oh, go on, show a bit of mercy. I am not that petty that I won't accept an apology. Good. I'll tell Alicia she's babysitting then, shall I? As I might have mentioned it, you know, just in passing. Maybe. Have to see what this looks like on my first one. Me. Oh, come on. What is the point in a killer dress if you can't flaunt it? OK, well, just the one in here. You know, I had to sell what is left of my soul to get a table at that place. I was thinking about this, right? Launching my own perfume range and what I might call it. I was thinking I might call it gloat. <laughs> Flippin' egg. Do you wear a ball gown to do the hoovering nowadays? Well, you know my motto? Never knowingly underdressed. Well, then, give us a twirl. Oh, my God, you cow! They are paying you way too much. No, 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 this is a freebie. Yeah, he 
just keeps bringing these things home for me. Like I said, mate, there's always a price. Let me guess. She's making you take her somewhere posh. Nobody's making me do anything. You obviously haven't read the user's manual when it comes to work. Unlike you, he doesn't need to, if you get my drift. You better just go where you're going. Mm, are you going to hit me? Don't you make out like I ever laid a finger on you. Whoa, if I'd known you could still move that fast, I wouldn't have gone looking elsewhere. You will go to whoever's paying. Yeah. One of the many things he can do that you can't. What, like, like going into women's clothes shops for you? Yeah, big man. Yeah. Because it takes a real man not to worry about those things. A real man who knows how to treat a lady. The only way you will ever really satisfy a woman is by dropping dead. Right, come on. Okay. <laughs>